How to configure remote desktop services on Rack PC server and matchless IPC thin client. Here is the description of the architecture used to implement a remote desktop session. The server is a Rack PC based with Windows Server 2012. The client is composed by an HMI BMI with Windows 10. This implementation will be done in two steps. In step 1, we are going to install the remote desktop services and access rights on the server. Open Server Manager tool, click on Manage. Select Add Roles and Features. Click Next. On the Installation Type window, select Role Based, then Next. Select your server name. Click Next. On the Server Roles window, check Remote Desktop Services. Click Next. Click Next. Click Next. On Role Services window, we are going to select the tools required to run the Remote Desktop Services into the server. Select Remote Desktop Licensing and Add. Select Remote Desktop Session Host and Add. Select Remote Desktop Web Access and Next. Then Install. To complete the installation, the server must be restarted. Login with administrator rights. You can see that all the services have been correctly installed. Now, the services are running in a trial mode of 120 days. To be able to use the remote desktop after the trial period, you have to buy a license and use Remote Desktop Licensing Manager for the registration. Now we are going to configure the users and access rights. From Tools menu, select Computer Management. From Local Users and Groups menu, right click on User Folder and add new user. Enter username and password. Set up the password management options then create. For this example, we created a second user. Now, select group in order to authorize these two users to access to the remote desktop services. Double click on remote desktop users and add the two users to this group.
you can verify that the users have access to the remote desktop services. By IP config we get the IP address of the server to be connected. In this example, we want to simplify the server access. We disabled the network level authentication. In normal use, the network level authentication is recommended. After the step 1, we are going to explain in the step 2 how to access to the server from the thin client. From the Windows menu of the client, launch the Remote Desktop Connection tool. Enter the IP address of the server then connect. Enter the username and password. This pop-up window confirms that we are connecting to the server without security certificate. As you can see we are now connected to the server from the thin client. We have total access to the applications. For this example, we will use SCADA application. We can navigate through all the panels of the application. We can display the animation panel. Make actions. We can display the alarms and the trends.